to check out the uh, Celestron Eclipse Smart Solar Filter. This is for the 8 inch uh, SCT, and we're going to see if it's any good. As you can see, it's very similar to the uh, faceplate already. It just has a cutout and a filter on it. So you discover when you first start using it, uh, these little tabs here that kind of push in just barely on your normal cap. It's been on your scope for so long, they're kind of pushed in already and it kind of goes on easily. On this, you'll line it up and you have to kind of push these tabs in just a little bit so they can pop in. I'm sure you'll have to do that, you know, a couple dozen times before it finally uh, starts working right. And there'll be no need for any tapping or try to force it in. Just uh, line up with the grooves and just kind of push those tabs in just a little bit and they'll fit just fine. Now when you want to align this scope with the sun, the easiest way is just take this cap off. Don't put the solar filter on yet. Take this back end off so it's clear. And then just uh, kind of zero in where you think it, the sun is. And then you're going to line up when the sun shows through the back end. And you'll see it on the ground. Then you know it's uh, you're aligned, lock it in, and you're ready to start shooting. So is the solar filter worth its money for $40, $50 that you might find it online? Yes, it works just as it says. It's nice and snug in there, even though it comes with some Velcro. Uh, once you have it locked in, it's not really going to go anywhere. Fire away because it really, really works pretty.